friends welcome back to my channel today we are going to solve the question answers from the 8th social geography the earth our planet let's start the first part it is fill in the blanks with the suitable words the first question is the total geographical area of the earth is 510 million square kilometers the second the shape of the earth is geoid third the equatorial and the polar diameters of the earth is 12756 and 12714 kilometers fourth one the 230 and 30 north latitude is called as tropic of cancer the fifth one is the indian standard time is based is based on 82% of east longitude now answer the following questions briefly why is the earth called living planet the answer is the earth is the home for all forms of life like plants animals and human beings because of its suitable distance from the sun range of temperature life supporting gases atmosphere water cycle etc it is the only planet that supports life that is why it is called living planet next question is why are the northern and southern hemispheres called land and water hemispheres the answer is the northern hemisphere has 60% of land and 40% of water therefore it is called the land hemisphere the southern hemisphere has 81% of water and 19% of land in the southern hemisphere so it is called the water hemisphere the next question what are the latitudes and longitudes the answer is latitude is a horizontal imaginary line which joins all the places which have the same angular distance north or south of the equator it is measured in the degrees longitude the imaginary vertical lines that is intersect equator at right angle joining the north and south are called longitudes mention the difference between local time and standard time the answer is local time the time according to the longitude of a place or according to the position of the sun at the place is known as the local time this is based on the local meridian passing over that place when the sun is shining vertically over the longitude it is 12 noon at that place all places situated on the same meridian have the same local time every longitude has its own local time next standard time to avoid much confusion that arises from following the local time which differs from place to place many countries follow uniform time throughout the country such uniform time is based on the central meridian of the country or the meridian on which the most important city is located this uniform time which is followed throughout a country is called standard time of that country this is all the answer for the local time and the standard time okay the next question is what is the international date line the answer is the circum navigation of the world brought a new problem in keeping the correct date and day in the week for the travelers therefore a line passing through 180 degree meridian diametrically opposite to the gmt it means greenwich meridian time was adopted as the point where circum navigation should make adjustments this line is supposed to pass pacific ocean along the 1800 meridian but makes short detours in order to avoid land masses 
This is known as the international date line because the date and day is changed whenever people cross this line by ships or airplanes. Now define the following. The question is unique planet. The earth is called a unique planet because of its features. It is the only planet that supports life. The earth is the home for all forms of life like plants, animals and human beings. Because of its suitable distance from the sun, range of temperature, life supporting gases, atmosphere, water cycle etc. This is about unique planet. The next is size of the earth. The earth is the fifth largest planet in the sun's family. The diameter of the earth is approximately four times greater than the moon and it is around 107 times less than that of the sun. The total geographical area is 510 million square kilometers. This is about size of the earth. Next one is geoid. The shape of the earth is often described as geoid, which literally means earth shaped or oblate spheroid. The earth is flattened at the poles and bulges at the equator. The equatorial diameter of the earth is 12,756 kilometers and the polar diameter is 12,714 kilometers. Equatorial circumference 40,008 kilometers. The difference of 42 kilometers in the diameter is the proof for regarding the geoid shape of the earth. The next one is continents. The land bodies of the earth are known as continents. There are seven continents, namely Asia, Africa, North America and South America, Antarctica, Europe and Australia. The continents are land masses of large size. Asia is the largest continent and Australia is the smallest continent in the world. The next one is prime meridian. Lines of longitude are called meridians. Meri means med, mid and dian means day. Because all places along the same meridian of longitude experience noon or midday at the same time. The meridian passing through Greenwich in England has been chosen as prime meridian. It is marked as zero degree longitude. This is all about prime meridian. The next one is the last one about Indian standard time. In India 824 degree east longitude is considered as the standard meridian of the country. It passes through Allahabad of Uttar Pradesh. The time based on this meridian meridian is called the Indian Standard Time that means IST. It is 5 hours and 30 minutes ahead of GMT. Thank you friends. I hope you like my videos. If you like my videos, please, please, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you once again.